Hey guys, this is HGM Mario, and I'm showing you my barcode account. Um, this is an account that I've been playing on, I've been practicing it on. I have not been practicing on my HGM Mario account because this season I decided, you know, the season's still new, it's early. I don't care so much about Grandmaster. I'm going to test some some strategies. Since I'm very confident in my ability to get back up into Grandmaster, I didn't really bother playing so much um, during the first days it was released, so I missed the deadline of it opening. No big whoop, I'll get back in there really soon. Uh, I want to show you guys, this is my barcode. So, what I've been testing here is just as I mentioned, new strategies, there's some chasers, there's some macro transitions, some timing pushes. Um, and on this account, it's, uh, it's raised quite a bit. I faced people like Idra on here. Um, I did lose, I was testing a timing push, and I missed the deadline by 20 seconds. And if I was there sooner, he would have lost the game, but. What a shame. Um, this is, these, are, these are all fun games. I love experimenting, and I wanted a second account to purely experiment, and I wanted a main account to play standard on. Although I'm always tempted to experiment more, to learn more. I love to learn. I love to thrive. I love to increase my knowledge of StarCraft, and especially my knowledge of Mech. So, <laughs> it's, it's really fun. I, I enjoy the game. Um, I wish Blink Stalkers weren't in the game, but I enjoy the game. Um, overall, I think it's pretty balanced. So um, on this account, we have statistics, a 63% win loss against Protoss, 66% against Terran, and 73% uh, against Zerg. Um, it's fairly high up. If we take a look and pull this up here and go to the global section, we can see my barcode being right here. Which one is it? It's this one. Out of all the Master League players in North America, I am right now number 24, and I'm behind with about 130 points to be promoted to Grandmaster. So, this is actually my experiment account. So my experiment account is pretty close to Grandmaster by itself, and uh, that's pretty nice. It gives me a good feeling knowing that I have no problem getting way up high in the middle of the season facing mostly... Uh, you know, top 20, top 50 Grandmasters right now. So, yeah. Like, uh, I played Neeb earlier today. He was also in the Challenger uh, tournament in WCS, and it was a fun game. I cheesed him. I was testing out something specific, but uh, he's a very talented player. Uh, very much respect for him as a player. So, um, yeah. So below, uh, uh, the reason why I bring this up is because uh, I'm releasing a replay pack this evening in this video. Uh, replay pack is something I do on occasion, depends on if I'm in a great mood, if I have a lot of replays, um, if I have something viable for you to give. <coughs> Sometimes I don't release a replay pack for a long time because I don't feel like there's anything new and I always want to provide you with new content. I want to I provide you with something you can learn with, something to really help you out. And in this you will see a lot of reactor Hellion openings against Perdoth. It's one of the things that I've been perfecting here. Um, you will see lots of Zergs. I've gotten so good at, at, at Terran against Zerg. It's easily my best matchup because it's the one I understand the most. I I understand Terran against Zerg very well, I think. I, I, yeah, very well. It's probably my more confident matchup. I practice it a lot. Uh, there, there are actually a lot of Zergs on ladder, so yeah. As you can probably tell if we take a quick look we'll see that I've played 41 games against Zerg, 38 against Prodos, 29 against Terran so I play Zergs a lot more than anything else anyway so thanks for watching guys I will have the replay pack with the link below I hope you guys enjoy them I hope you guys use them if you have any more feedback commentary if you would like to throw something in. Um, I also want to say that I'm going to fall on some hard times soon because my wife will be delivering in about a month and there's been some problems um, that I've been experiencing, some personal problems that I've been experiencing. So I don't know how many videos I will be putting up. Um, I will have to pick up a part-time job and play a little bit less to help cover some bills. So, well, once everything is settled up, I'll try to put up a lot more videos. But until then, it's going to be a little bit slower. Um, I'm, I'll definitely be putting a, a lot of videos uh, as much as I can. I won't be skimping any, but, you know, it'll be uh, maybe not as frequent. 
maybe like four or five in one day a week or or maybe one or two spread out every other few days so yeah thanks for watching guys i hope you've been enjoying the youtube please remember to follow me on twitch at twitchtv.com slash h2mario uh, my viewer count has been really low lately uh, it's very discouraging actually to play uh, when i used to have like 100 people on a regular basis even up to 150 and all of a sudden I, I have a really hard time getting up to 30 people watching me on a regular basis i don't know if mech is boring it's uh it, it is it's actually very discouraging discouraging because um i feel like there must be either something wrong with me or my play style that people just simply don't want to watch and i'd love it if you guys tuned in 9 a.m mountain time every morning so yeah thanks for watching guys i really hope you guys tune in i have like 900 subscribers if half of you could turn in a few times in a row i can turn off ads stream without ads permanently i am not interested in advertisements um, i'm not interested in revenue really from starcraft i play it for fun i, t I play it to teach um, I, I do like to sell a few coachings occasionally to help keep the hobby active but i really really I'm not much of a, a person I, I mean I want to go professional but I, I'm, I'm not a person who really you know I, I have other things as well so if I'm, if I'm low on funds or something I'll pick up a job for a while pick up and then head, dive right back into StarCraft so yeah thanks for watching guys